Hello everyone, it's me once again. So just want to give you a quick tip on my experience with Kindle. This has been just over a year since I bought it. And recently there was a problem with the battery. Okay, what I mean by that is, let's say if I were to fill up the battery to 100% next day, the morning, uh, about uh, 15 hours later, from 100% it will be drained all the way down to 10, 15% remaining. And that really annoyed me three days in a row. And as I thought, what am I going to do? Is there a battery problem and etc. Um, so what I've done is I switched into, I make sure the Bluetooth and the Wi-Fi connection was turned off by going to these three buttons here on the settings. You will see the Wi-Fi and Bluetooth. So you'll be able to turn, turn these both thing off. But still, after 100 recharge the very next day, um, it will still be drained down to 10 to 15 percent. So I just thought um, before I make any dramatic change on this whole situation, why not give Amazon a call? So they asked me number one is to recharge the um, Kindle when it, the battery is drained down to 30 percent without the case. Okay, without the case because it might be overheating, which I just I wasn't really convinced by that. Anyway, um, number two is to reset it so what you do is you go to these three buttons and you go to settings and um, when you go to device options you go to reset not restart but reset and don't worry if you do the reset um, you might lose some of the data um, data as well records of it but last time when you were connected to wi-fi make sure you connected to wi-fi to you know let, let the internet know what was your last page that you've been reading okay um, and it clearly remember exactly where the last bit I was reading on my Bible. I'm actually reading the King James Version, by the way. Um, and it recognized that page. So I didn't really technically lose any pages of what I was reading. So that's fine. So don't worry about resetting it if you are reading one book at a time, at least. That's what I want to say. And lastly, even though you reset it and let's say your battery is draining um, quickly, they're asking you to buy a ne next device but they will email you so make sure you give them a call about this make a complaint uh, not aggressively but make sure they are aware of it because they will give you 15 percent one five percent discount for your next purchase for kindle um, device despite uh, you lost your warranty period of this device. So this, I have had it for more than a year and they, despite that, they said they're going to promise to give me a 15% discount, which is not bad, better than nothing, but um, I'm pretty good on this stage. Um, it's been more than five hours since I charged it up to 100% and I deliberately put it onto the aeroplane mode and um, it's still 99%, which is really good. So I'm really pleased by that. So I just wanted to explain to you if you're having the same problem with your Kindle device, Make sure you follow those three procedures and um, I, th I think you'll be relatively happy. Um, I'm very happy because it seems somehow some updates have dramatically, deliberately programmed the Kindle to drain the battery for some reason. It was really annoying, but I'm sure this, I'm, I'm really glad that this whole software has now been disappeared. This is not mingling about with my battery and it's came, came back to normal. So I'm really pleased with that. So I just thought I will, I will let you guys know about this. So if you have any quick more questions about this, please do let me know. I'll come back to you as much as I can if I do know, but I hope this helped with your Kindle device. So thank you very much for watching this video. This is LJB Tech. All the best. Bye-bye.